Welcome back, little beans. Warning, the following ASMR is only aimed for beans who are in the need for comfort and positive energy from a favorite anime character. There won't be any NSFW versions of this ASMR. This is for all ages and is appropriate for all. However, if you feel uncomfortable from videos like this, then click off. To the ones who are staying, go right ahead and get all cozy in your blinkies, pop in your headphones, snack on some pockies, and enjoy this ASMR. So, Sukasa, did you get your homework done last night? Yeah, I got it all done, brother. Are you sure? Because back at home, I heard you were having a kissing session with Listener. Oh, come on. Just because she's my tutor does not mean, like, I have to treat her like she's my teacher. Gotta spice things up a bit, Amine. You're so weird, but did you at least get it done? All done, brother. Ready to be turned in. Speaking of Listener, where is she? I don't know. I think they're being dropped off by the bus. I think they'll be arriving... Oh! There's the bus. I think they're coming out right now. Sweet. I can't wait to see my sweet little baby muffin. You come up with the weirdest nicknames. Aw, are you jealous, Amine, that I get a girlfriend and you don't? Shut up. Well, here comes the other students. Um, I'm trying to... I don't see her from anywhere. Me either. Hold on. There she is! Why? She looks like she's in a hurry. I'm gonna go follow her. Wait, wait, let me come with you. Where are they going? I see they're heading to their bathroom. Don't tell me you're gonna go in there. Oh, come on. Me and Listen have been doing it for a while now. No one ever spots me. Are you telling me... No! Don't worry, Amine. We don't go any further. Sometimes we like to chill and play card games in there. And yeah, we do kiss. Well, at least it's better. You worry too much, Amine. Well, good thing there's not a lot of people, so... Could you knock? You know I always knock, just to make sure the coast is clear. Oh, listener, are you in there? All right, she's in there. Come on, Amine, but we gotta be quick. Okay. On you, Mark. Go! <laughs> that was easy, huh? Well, there's still a window. That's why we pulled the blinds down. Good thinking, Sukasa. Oh, listener, I know you're hiding from me. I don't think they're hiding. Come on, baby muffin, where are you? Huh? I hear sobbing. Don't tell me. Oh, listener, it's Tsukasa and Amine. Can you come out of the stall, please? Because we want to say good morning. There you are. <laughs> listener, have you been crying? Who did this to you, baby muffin? Tell me and I'll kill them for you. Sukasa! I am being truthful. No one makes my listener cry like that. Who did this? And what are you wearing? It doesn't look like your normal clothes that you wear every day. I mean, it doesn't really suit you. What about the cute dresses you wear? Or the cute little punk kawaii style you wear? Wait, what? Are you telling me the other day those group of girls picked fun at you? Why, though? What is that sound? Amine, was that you? Are you hungry? I thought you had breakfast. I did have breakfast, Sukasa. 
Well, it's not my tummy. Wait a minute. Listener, you didn't have breakfast this morning? Listener, you must have breakfast. It's the important meal of the mor of, of the day. That was a stutter, Amine. I'm just... Why didn't you eat? I'm sorry. Are you saying that not eating a lot would make you skinny? Who in the right mind would tell you that? Don't tell me you're listening to those girls. You know they're just... They could be just jealous that you're way beautiful than they are. Amine, you're talking to my girlfriend, so back off. You know I'm not hitting on her, Sukasa. Back off. I'm just helping. Baby, why would you ever listen to those bitches? You still need to eat no matter what. And plus, if you do not eat, you will die. We don't want you to die, baby. Because how can I be with you if you're gone? Exactly. Now anyway, I will give you my breakfast if you want. Here's some rice. Maybe it'll help you fill up your tummy. Wait, Tsukasa, where did you get that? I stole it from Mom. I'm not going to say anything, but I, I, I understand. They are pretty good. And why would those girls call you fat? I don't see any fat on you. Neither do I. You look perfect and normal. Yeah. I mean, your arms, they look fine. Your tummy, well, it's a little muffy toppy, but that's fine. You know, I'll still worship it. Your legs, not, not that big. Your chest. Mm. <laughs> Sukasa, grow up. I'm just worshipping them. I mean... Listener, if you were indeed overweight, I would still cherish you. I mean, you know I was good for personalities, and you'd be so huggable. Of course I would mean it. But you look so normal and beautiful. Now eat up. That's it. <laughs> you need some protein in your tummy. Well, that was really nice of you, Sukasa. But I do have some extra herbal tea for you if you want some, you know, to chug it down. Well, Amine, I never knew you carry extra tea. Sometimes I need it for stress. Well, here, here you go. And don't worry about, you know, anyone coming in. We turned down the blinds and we locked the door. Wait, what? Just saying. <sighs> Whatever. Do you feel better now, baby muffin? Oh, of course. I mean, I don't judge you. I mean, the only thing I'm going to judge is not you eating and looking like your old self. All we're saying is, don't ever listen to what those girls are saying. Just because they say stuff like that doesn't mean you have to do it for them. They just wanted to hurt you because you're easy. And we understand that you're really soft and really kind to others. But sometimes you need to, you know, not listen to them. Yeah, baby, they don't speak the truth. We do. Oh, you're done. Well, good. Now chug on some tea. I'll throw this away in the bin. Aw, no problem, listener. We'll always be there with you. Yeah, remember the song that I sang to you for the talent show? You know, that Bruno Mars song? Yeah, I sang that song just for you. Because you are truly amazing just the way you are. You don't need to change yourself. I mean, if you want to do some changes, you just got to tell me. You know I will still love you and worship you. So don't starve yourself, and don't wear this ugly-ass turtleneck again. I understand it could be cozy, but I like your style. Yeah, and same with those guys. 
What they said about you looking like a boy? I mean, that's their problem. Plus, you look cute when you look like a tomboy. Yeah, I like it with any sort of style. Goth, girly, tomboy. Heck, or just lazy. You're just... <clears throat> Tsukasa, I'm just saying. It's just... I just love my baby. You're so childish. Shut up, Amine. Well, it looks like we do have about ten minutes until school starts, so... I'm gonna go head to class and possibly finish up my project. All right, Amine. I'll just stick the side listener and comfort her. Are you sure about that? You're not going to do anything? I promised, Amine. All right. I'll see you guys later. Hope to see you in class. Please take care, listener. And take our advice. We love you, and we think you are beautiful. <laughs> well, speaking from the boy's point of view... It is indeed factual. Bye. Now that my twin brother is gone, what do you say we can spend the next ten minutes kissing? You heard me, baby muffin. I just wanted to show my love to you. Doesn't matter what you really look like. <laughs> do you think I'm that shallow like those other guys? Exactly. Now, let's head to one of the stalls and I will cherish you. Hmm? You have to be in class early? Okay, okay, how about five minutes? Six minutes. Okay, okay, three minutes. Three minutes of your sweet boyfriend, Sukasa. Worshipping his sweet, adorable girlfriend. Now, come here, baby muffin. Mwah, mwah, mwah. <laughs> mwah. Oh, you're so cute when you're all red. If these bitches ever lay a hand on you, I'll deal with them. And to prove who is the ugly and fat one. Because it's not you. Mm-hmm. <laughs>